Good morning team, welcome back to another video. You've just seen my me do my check-in. Last week, actually the beginning of this week, I started an eight week block of training where the main goal is to increase strength and maintain weight, track food and be more fit and healthy. Sort of coming out of lockdown, the back end of lockdown was easy to sort of mess up my diet. So I just wanted to be back on point a bit. Today we're going against that. Today we're going to do another food challenge. Uh, my last protein bar food challenge, uh, 24 hours of only eating grenade bars, and I reviewed them all and I told you which one's the best. Did pretty well. So I decided, let's do it again. Now, of late, I've been a fan of Battle Bites. Now, I've picked them up in Home Bar, which you might have seen a few clips of me picking them up. Uh, so I decided I was going to pick up some of their latest, well, all of their protein bars. So I picked up a variety pack. I picked up a box of their brand new bar, which is the marshmallow, white chocolate marsh, toasted marshmallow. And then I picked up a few bars that weren't in the variety pack. There is nine different protein bars to try, and today I'm gonna to do 24 hours of only eating Battle Bite bars and review all of the best bars. And what's gonna be even better is, I haven't tried about five or six of these bars, so I'm proper hyped to try it, and you'll get an honest review uh, of the first time I've tried it. Also, these bars have been sat in my cupboard for about two weeks now, and I've been dying to do this challenge, and I just didn't know what day to do it. Uh, body weight was kind of low today, so I thought, do you know what, let's just do it. So I tend to fast until midday. I've got four sessions back to back now, from eight till 12, and normally I'd fast till 12. Having said that, I've got to get down nine different types of protein bars today and I think it's probably better if I get a meal in or a meal a bar in before. So I was trying to look at the variety pack or look at the bars that I've got and think what is the most breakfast like and there's not one. So I'm just going to go for a bar that I've never tried and we're going to go for the Mississippi Mud Pie Bar. So. Uh, I will put the macros on screen. What I love about um, Battle Bites by the way team is they are two separate bars. So they come in two bites, hence the name Battle Bite, which allows you to have one, which will be about 10 grams of protein, and then you can put the one, other one in the fridge for the next day or even later in the day. Just allows you to break it up, it's a lot easier. Because when you start eating a protein bar, Chances are you're gonna eat the whole thing. If you've got two separate bars like this, it's a lot easier. Oh shit, I'm dropping white chocolate stars. It's a lot easier to separate and hide it and have it, have it later. So, never had this one before. Let's give it a whirl. Not bad. A little chewy, but very tasty. That's a good chocolate taste. Yeah, it actually just tastes a bit like a chocolate bar. Rate that very highly. 8.5. First time ever trying that one. As a solid one to go in the books. Right, I'm gonna finish this one, head to work, and then I'll have the next bar just before I work out. We've made it to sort of quarter past 12 ish. Uh, I'm just about to start my workout. Well, I just did a 5k on a bike, made up some pre. Uh, it's best time for a bar, I've got to get nine of these bad boys in. So, this is their latest bar, this is their newest bar, White Chalk Toasted Marshmallow. This is what I'm probably most excited about. Oh, it's weird. Like I say, I always fast at about this time anyway. Having that protein bar earlier has made me so hungry. Uh, but I tell you what, it was actually so good. Like, yeah, the more I had that bar, that, that better I got. This is how we're looking. Looks actually very similar to the, can you see that focused? Looks very similar to the grenade bar, the grenade white chocolate cookie dough with marshmallows. Oh, that's good. Mmm. Yeah, again, another fantastic bar. I'm not sure if I actually prefer the other one from earlier. Such a good bar. Normally I prefer the white chocolates, but that bar earlier was really good. In terms of today's session, guys, we're on an upper body, so we got alternating for some push pull exercises. I'll add in my 5k there and then we'll do a little tiny conditioner to finish. Ooh, small wins every session, that's all we're trying to take. Last week, set of 80, 93 and a half for three on bench this week. Second round of bench press in the heavier round. First set of three, 95, let's see if we get two more. By the way, I love that I'm getting gassed over hitting 95 kilos. Like, Jesus, I've lost some serious strength. 
Uh, my best all time 3x3 three three was a 110, so a lot of work to do, but we're making progress. Good workout then, like I said, it was an upper body workout to finish the week off. And then I just did a 21 15 9, so 21 reps of three exercises, 15 reps of three exercises, nine. Seven minutes on the dot, and it was just a nice little bit of conditioning. Right, I suppose we should go on to bar three. So I'm yet to take any bars from the selection pack, but I've just realized I've just left this in the car and it's quite warm. So I'm gonna put that in the fridge when I get home and I'll have this bad boy. Uh, this is caramel pretzel. I got this from once again from Home Bargains, and this is a bar that I've had before. So both those two other bars I haven't had before. Uh, by the way, that marshmallow bar was slightly on the higher calorie side. These are all slightly on the high, well I say slightly higher. They're about 220. Once again, I'll put the macros on the screen. Not bad macros at all. all every single bar, right? has some sort of vibiness on the top so this has got pretzel bites and i know this bar is legit teach them talk about fueling your workouts fueling your body after a workout brain bars mate right then it is quarter of three i'm really hungry so like, like i said that all i've had is the three protein bars so far which is about 600 calories so no wonder i'm hungry but we've had no real source of food. So, oh, look at this. Eh? Ah, oh, day's ruined. Fuck. The day is ruined. So look, right pack, on the front it shows birthday cake, carrot cake, chocolate coconut, cookies and cream, chocolate caramel, and red velvet. Well, in here we have chocolate coconut, which I'm not looking forward to. Cookies and cream, I am looking forward to. Chocolate caramel. Oh, I've got caramel pretzel, so I didn't need to go and buy that one. Birthday cake. I've got the new marshmallow one, so I didn't need to buy that. Carrot cake, buzzing. Mud pie, had that this morning to be fair, that was fucking great. Red velvet. And then they've doubled up on Caramel pretzel, birthday cake, and marshmallow. So, I bought those other ones when I didn't really need to, but oh well, we'll go for it. I thought it was two of each. So, is there any that I'm missing? No. Right, what one do I want? This is the hardest decision of the day. We'll do a super set. Two bars that I've never tried before. Cookies and cream, red velvet. Two to seven calories. I swear to God, they have just nailed flavours. And the red velvet. This one looks a little vibey, you know? That one is the most artificial tasting. But once again, not bad at all. I think it's because it's the fifth protein bar that I'm saying that, but if that was the first one of the day, I'd still be loving it. Macros and ratings on green. By the way team, if you're enjoying this video so far, make sure you smash that like button, hit subscribe, and let me know down below what other brands you'd like me to try. I am starving. It is now uh, quarter past six. I've just had a few uh, few more PTs. PT from home at the minute. It's, do you know what? It's the PT at the minute is the weirdest thing, like from parks, from homes, but I'm really enjoying it. It shows, uh, speaks volume about my clients, doesn't it? Like I'm really enjoying coaching at the minute, which is really nice, so anyway. Back to the right pack. It's mad that, like I say, I'm still really hungry, but I'm hungry. I'm also, I'm obviously craving normal food, like a proper meal, but I'm still also craving protein bars. Well, chocolate in general, which is probably just shows how much of a sweet tooth I already have. So the four bars that I have left to try, chocolate coconut, chocolate caramel, carrot cake, and birthday cake. Two of them I've had before, two of them I've never had, so I'm gonna pair them up. But I think I'm gonna wait for Rossi to get home, because she'll be home any minute, and I'll see what she's saying about food. My flight's not good. Mm. Not great. Friday night. 
We got four bars left. This light is shite, man. I want to put it here. Put it here. Let's try. Let me try. It's quite salty. Okay, that's not well. This might be a little bit better. So I'm not really into fish and chips takeaway, and Beth's been wanting one for flipping ages. So. She's decided to get fish and chips. Can you show the camera? Because it actually looks unreal. Well, she went for chicken nuggets. From my boy, CP and Liam. It looks decent. I really need some ketchup or something. So, uh, I'm on protein bars. She's on fish and chips. So I'm going to do, like I say, one that I haven't done, one that I have done. Let's do chocolate caramel mm. and carrot cake. Think about these bars also. Yeah, don't. Right, I'll poop in my car. They go everywhere. I've got that somewhere. No, we haven't. Right, yourself, woman. What's that one? Chocolate caramel. You smell really vinegary. It's not me. It's not me. It's the food. I should watch that go everywhere. Not bad, but not anything special. Probably the worst bar of the day. Not that, that like, all the bars have been decent. So, probably the least worst. Least favourite. Probably, yeah, least favourite. See, so, yeah, I, looked, I looked earlier on YouTube's analytics right if i put in the title i tried every batter bite bar nowhere near as much search as i only ate protein bars 24 hours so i've had to take one on the chin and only eat protein bars mm. carrot cake now this is one that i've had from home bargains if you're an og you know that i've had this before this is legit it's really hot <gasps> hey, what i'm mean, everywhere nah clean it up top tier stuff that but still, nothing has beaten Mrs. Mud Pie from earlier. Right, she wanted to try the carrot cake, so I let her have a bite and then I need to finish it. What do you rate that? Wait, first of all, you're not even a massive carrot cake fan. All protein bar fans. All protein bar fans, so what do you reckon? I don't know about carrot cake. As protein bars go. Oh, good. These, all, all of these battle bites today have really impressed me. Alright, should we try the other one? What's this? Chocolate caramel. That's definitely, that's not peanuts on the outside. No. Caramel. Is it from the carrot itself? Overpowering? No. I actually enjoyed that one more and more. More and more, the more I ate it. No, that was nice. That was good, wasn't it? Mm. Hmm. Read that to the carrot cake. Yeah, Josh. Oh, we just did evening steps and now I'm sort of flagging. My stomach hurts. It's a lot of fibre. I feel full, but not full. I'm not even really that hungry, but I'm not really craving other foods. I better be light in the morning as well. Obviously, we'll do our weigh in the morning. But let's eat these last two. I might only have half, to be fair. But the one that I'm not vibing about the most, that's why it's last, is the chocolate, coconut, and then the other one is birthday cake. We're going to be like a banking. The birthday cake, I know. Well, I've had it, I can't it? remember. I like that they're in halves. Yeah, I said earlier, it's so decent because what you can do is obviously have half, other yeah. half in the fridge, and then yeah. either come back to it later and feel like you've had like two snacks, two treats. Or share it with a friend. Or share it with a friend. So let's do coconut first. To be fair. Looks good. Don't look, de don't look too bad, does it? Once again, surprisingly, that actually doesn't taste that bad at all. Is it quite coconutty? I like a nice amount. I think it's just this little frosting on top. Mm. So anyone that's into coconuts, will probably like this. And the birthday cake. Sweet. Mmm, it's good. Do you want to try oh, a bit of this? Jesus, babe, you're getting that everywhere. Babe, you've done that everywhere. You can't see me. There's the lights behind you. Mmm. Good. Real sweet. Quite Real strawberry. Sweet. Yeah, that's, that's this little pink bit. Right, I'm checking it in the morning with oh, my weigh-in. Give you a review of bars one to nine, what's the best, what's the worst, in my opinion. And also, if I think they're better than the carb killer bars. Right team, let's round up the video. It is, what was it, 10 30. I am bloody starving this morning. I woke up so hungry. Uh, I was 79.3 this morning, so 0.2 up. Uh, and I only had about 
I think all those bars came out at like 15, 1600 calories. I only had half of the last two bars because I just fed up with protein bars. Uh, but that is not a fair representation of the bars. I tell you what, they are better than Carb Killer by a country mile. Uh, best bar, let's try and do best to worst real quick. Mississippi Mud Pie, uh, Caramel Pretzel, Marshmallow Toaster One, Carrot Cake, Cookies and Cream, and then the rest. But they were all good bars, like decent bars. But our bites bars are probably my favorite protein bars of all time as it stands. Uh, the other ones that I do want to do a little full day of eating only in protein bars is uh, PhD because their smart bars are decent. So smash the like button if you've enjoyed this video. If you want to see that, I'm about to go in and eat some normal food. Like I said, I'm bloody starving. I can't wait. I've missed cereal so much. It's only been 24 hours. Uh, if you've enjoyed the video, smash that like button, hit subscribe. I'll see you in the next one.